It was a pop-up shop and now it's a pop-up squat. We can't squat residentially anymore, so we can only squat commercially. We wouldn't be able to hire a shop or a place in Knightsbridge, with, we have no money. But by, not, you know, by squatting, we're able to get a place and then put forward our ideas. So that's kind of like the way that I see it, you know. You can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs, and if a squat is what that takes, then that's what we've done. We're occupying this building here for a week in order to draw attention to um, housing issues and trying to raise the profile of the um, demonstration that's happening on Sunday. It's a kill the housing bill demonstration. There's, there's no benefit for people already living in social housing from this bill. I got involved a long time ago. Uh, I live in North Kensington and we live on a council estate and we had some residential land that got taken away from us by the Royal Borough of Kensington Chelsea Council. But um, what we found out during this process was how the council was so disrespectful of, the, of us as a community and that kind of got us a little bit motivated as a community to not just be treated like this. I mean we live in a slum and we live in a slum not because we treat it like a slum, we live in a slum because our council doesn't invest in us. We pay our rent every week, you know, we love our community but our landlord, the TMO and the council don't respect us. Having been born in the Royal Borough of Kensington Chelsea, I don't believe that that we are bad people in this borough. In fact, I know that we're not bad people. Well, it's a beautiful borough with a lot of character that is being eroded now. What we're hoping to get out of it is just raising the issue of housing. I mean, housing affects everyone. So we're just kind of making people understand that they're not alone if they've got these issues. Hoping that people can come in here and if not just generally to get people thinking about housing and how they might, you know, what the future might look like and what they might do to help it not turning into the, the kind of the Tory ideal.